The following portion of Fox 43 AM Live is sponsored by Jayhawk. Coins, games, and more. Welcome back to Fox 43 AM Live. I'm back here at Jayhawk Coins, Games, and More with Matt. Good morning. Good morning. How are you doing? Good. You guys have been celebrating two years That's now right. this past month. That's right. How how was your you know your big extravaganza sale? Man, it was amazing. Mm -hmm. We had so many people come in. Uh, we saw so many friends. Uh, we gave away so many prizes. It was awesome. So cool, and, and there's so many, there's so much good stuff to to you know offer as prizes to come in, find great deals. That's right. On. It, it's really amazing, and it really is a testament of just what you have to offer the community. Two years now, at, right. at just at this location, it's, correct. It's amazing. And now the, the time of season, we've been getting um, flyers, things in the mail about selling gold. That's right. And that's something that you guys are particularly interested in yourself. Mm -hmm. And again, I think I want to come back to that. The testament of you've been here for two years now you know this community you know the local area and you know gold correct and so wh what's your opinion of kind of what's going on with some of these kind of flyers that people are getting this time of year so we're getting mailers tv spots mm -hmm. newspaper spots all kinds of things are being inundated into our market right now in fact one of these mailers just this last week an outfit's going to be coming into town they're advertising that gold is eighteen around eighteen hundred dollars an ounce. Okay. That's, that's, that that does sound good to me. Sounds great, except mm -hmm. for that's not true. Okay. Gold is just under twenty four hundred dollars an ounce. That sounds even better. Yes. So, in this scenario, we have a little bit of gold here, mm -hmm. and I'll hold it up for the camera. Just a little bit of gold. In that scenario, if you would take that little bit of gold to that outfit. Before you started negotiation, they would basically say that that gold is worth $400. In reality, it's worth $525. Wow. And so before you start neg your negotiation, you're upside down by $125 mm -hmm. before you start your negotiation. Yeah, and they're going to you know, talk you down a little bit because they are going to want to make a profit. Correct. And they're going to start at that $1,800 mm -hmm. range instead of the true, to, as of the filming of this, it was... Twenty-three eighty-five. Wow. Okay. That that is a huge difference. It's great that you know we have people like you who are kind of looking out for those prices. Correct. And I think it comes down to again, this is like these are traveling shows. They're going all across the country. Correct. You know, you're possibly going to make a sale. They're going to leave, and then you're out. Correct. But you're here. You've been at this location for two years. You know where to come back to. And That's right. Again, you know how to properly help the community out. You have to see me at stores. All you have to see me at the grocery store, the lumber yard. <laughs> Yeah. And so it's wonderful what you guys are doing here. And now I also want to say, you know, again, you're traveling out around the community. Uh, we've got Lawrence FanCon 64 coming That's right. up soon. Uh, next weekend, uh, we're going to be in Lawrence FanCon 64. Um, the shop's going to be open as well. So head over to Lawrence, come over to the shop, mm -hmm. either or. What kind, of, what kind of stuff will be over at the show in Lawrence on the 15th? Uh, I think we're going to take a little bit of everything. Um, so we'll have all of our different verticals there except for the coins mm -hmm. um, and sports cards um, at that show. So we'll have our Pokemon, the comics, the action figures, a bunch of the pop culture stuff over there. Awesome. It's going to be a little, a little slice of the store over That's right. Lawrence. That's going to be so cool. And also, can... Can people come to the kind of uh, conventions and bring you stuff to buy there, or would you prefer them to come here? So, yes and no. Mm -hmm. I wouldn't want to bring large collections, um, but if you want to trade a few items yeah. here and there, that's fine. Okay. Sure. Uh, yeah, a small thing. So, yeah, don't don't be bringing your gold necessarily to the conventions. Bring them over. <laughs> bring them here to the store. That's correct. Yeah, Matt will take care of you guys. Yes. Yeah. That's yep. more fantastic. I'm gonna have to go digging through my closet now, and maybe some old jewelry I have somewhere stashed away from an old relative or whatnot, yep. and see what I can do with it. Yep. Well, Matt, thank you so much for joining, for letting me join you today this That's morning. Right. And again, thank you for kind of keeping an eye out for the community around the area because. Again, if without you, some people, some people like you, we would be down, you know, a couple hundred dollars in every little dollar counts nowadays. That's right. Oh, thanks again. Thank you. The preceding portion of Fox 43 AM Live was sponsored by Jayhawk. Coins, games, and more.